this is not, not the 112 Collective Mezco Spider-Man. Spider All right, yeah. Awesome. What's up, everyone? Thanks for joining us once again on the V-Stars Zero One channel. I'm your host, Dexter Raffulis, and we have a special guest again because you guys want her back. Who is this? Janelle. That's right, I have my wife, Janelle Raffulis, and we're going to look at... A bootleg, a clone, a KO, a knockoff, something that you get off AliExpress so I can bash this on the table and that's probably why they break all the time. No, I'm just kidding. These are always broken no matter what. We're looking at a fake and a clone of the Mezco Spider-Man. I'm going to open this up. We're going to see how it is. Is it worth the 25 bucks, or should you just pay 100 bucks for the real deal? We're going to find out today. Are you excited about this, hon? No, you're not. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm so excited. Yay. <laughs> Yay, so this is the first time I've opened this and looked at it. As you can see here on the top cam, we're looking at Spider-Man. Um, he looks to be more like Pajama Man, but I guess we're gonna look and see how that is. My lovely assistant will take the box and stuff away. Uh, sure, let's just put this away as well. What you're here for is the figure, right? That's what you're here for. So I've had this for a while. I've been wanting to do this, and now today is the day that we can finally unveil this fake Spider-Man. Let's go to the front cam, and let's see. Whoa, wow. something is definitely not right with this guy. <laughs> Did they, like, freeform mold him out of... Oh, man. Like, oh, okay, no, 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 no. What, what's going his on here? This is uneven. Okay, this is what I think is definitely wrong with this. Clearly, the Spider-Man head is really small, right? Especially when you compare it to the rest of his body. Like, what is going on here? I, it, it's almost like they said, you know what? People don't care. They just want a figure to look like Spider-Man. So they took the Punisher body, put the clothes of Spider-Man on, because that's what, what Mezco does. They have soft goods. And, uh, the, yeah, they, the, that's it. And then they put, like yeah, that. yeah, l look at this. Wow, he, it looks like Spider-Man has worked out a little bit too much. Um, and somebody cut off his forearms and his yeah. lower halves of his legs and reattached <laughs> other body parts. Uh, something is going on here, and yeah, this this, like this doesn't Frank look good. This, this is, is totally not... a Frank and Spidey. Um, this does not look good at all. But you know what? Let's let's just go dive deeper and, and let's see. Mm. Is is this salvageable? Uh, yeah, I mean, there's no real big issues in paint in, in the head, I, I guess. May, maybe a little bit. It looks a little bit washed out. Or maybe they, there's an uneven black paint there. That's really it. The suit, I mean, it's Spider-Man, right? I mean, that's, that's really all I can, I can say. Gosh. But you know what? Maybe he's flexible. So let's look at articulation and scale. So I, I think I, <laughs> I think Janelle and I can agree that this does not look like Spider-Man. It looks absolutely atrocious. It looks awful, guys. Come on. Anyway, let's look at articulation and scale. So let's see how tall he is, and let's compare him with other action figures. This guy is standing at six and a quarter, maybe a little bit above when it comes to inches. And let's compare them with other action figures. So here's a real deal. Tom Holland, Spider-Man from Homecoming. And here's my favorite Spider-Man figure that I have played with a lot since, like what, 2004, seven? One of those. That's the Swivel Man, Spider-Man from Toy Biz. So as you can see, they, they kind of just look really bad. Uh, oh, sorry, he looks really bad in comparison. Of course, we have the Sentinel, Peter B. Parker. So, just, guys, just come on. Come on, look how big his chest is. Ah, these clones, man. Anyway, let's go Batman, the real deal. He's like, I hate you, Spider-Man. You look awful. Anyway, let's go ahead and look at articulation. We have an up and down here at the ankle shirt. Sure, we have a double jointed knee. Uh, you know what? Hey, you know what? This isn't half bad right here. At least he can kick up and down. Well, well maybe not this one. But the sidekick works. Um, there is 
some sort of rotation there. Man, he just looks that so weird. weird. He just looks so weird, right? There's no real ab crunch, I don't think. No, and uh, we do have some sort of. No, we we don't even get butterfly joints. We do get um, like a bicep swivel at least, double jointed elbow, and this giant enormous wrist peg. Like, what is this? It's not even hiding it. Let me just show you here on Batman. Do you see a ginormous wrist peg? No, it's kind of hidden. It's kind of into the forearm. This one's like, I don't care. I got a giant wrist peg. Who cares, right? So <laughs> there it is with his smaller hand. And of course, two joints right here at the neck looking to be well above 20 points of articulation. Let's look at the bright side on. He's not falling apart. Right? He's not falling apart. If, if you want a joke, <laughs> I'm pretty like, sure you said that prematurely. I mean, <laughs> I mean, if you want like a a funny looking like Spider Man, this this might work. This might work. But let's look at accessories here. Let's see what we're looking at. We have a re. Whoa, 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 whoa! What is this? What is this head? Oh my! Oh, oh, what? oh, kind of oh! Nightmare fuel! Oh, what is this? What is wrong? <laughs> like a black hole appeared in the middle of his oh face. Oh my gosh, no, 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 this, this, the, the web is off center and the eyes are off center and then the paint just makes it worse. And let's put this nightmare fuel, um, Spider-Man head. Sure, oh, that's totally Spider-Man right there, guys. I'm being sarcastic. Uh, yeah, no, 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 this is, uh, this is not good. This is... Uh, I know a figure's not good when the inner Jeff Goldblum, uh, no, comes out, and that, that is not good. Uh, yikes. Uh, well, l let's look here. At least we get this cool Spider-Man stand. Yeah? Let's look at the top cam real quick. Uh, Eric, my video editor, is going to show this. You see, look at that. You can have a really cool Spider-Man um, base there. As you can see, that looks really, really nice. Uh, I get, I get, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's just be real. Uh, and then, sure, other webs and stuff. Sure, you know what? I'm just going to do one. Just one. I'm just going to do one. We're going to see how it looks when we put this one on the wrist. As you can see, I'm already checking out. Janelle, am I checking out here? Are you checking out? I'm not digging this Spider-Man at all. I don't like he it. just looks really weird. But you know what? I have an issue with the color, the print, <laughs> the way that it moves on his chest. Yeah. How everything is just not so uh, well. I don't. Like yeah, and the webs don't really work with the wrists, as you can see in the front cam here. Uh, yeah, that that just doesn't. I mean, at least it sticks. Uh, but that oh. joint is really obvious. Okay, let's come with the conclusion. I I want this over with. This is a nightmare. I have young Frankenstein <laughs> stuck in my head. <laughs> yeah, this looks weird. This is the weirdest looking Spider-Man figure I think I have ever seen in my life. He has a small head. He has a humongous chest. His legs are like Arnold Schwarzenegger after getting pumped up. And he's got like really wide shoulders. It just looks awful. It looks Man. like he's wearing hockey or football pads. And yeah, it kind of does. But, but that's kind of like the musculature like that's supposed to pop out. But Let's let me let me get off the negative side and let's get on the positive side because yeah. we have some time here to talk about the positives. He didn't break in my hands. Uh, nothing's falling off. That's good. Uh, he can sidekick really nicely. Um, you know, you want a weird looking Frankenstein like Spider-Man, and this is the one to have, I guess. <laughs> so if you want a really weird looking Spider-Man, sure, go for it. Get this one. You can get it on AliExpress. Just go look up Mezco Spider-Man. You're going to find him there. But you know what? If you want 100% quality action figures like this awesome Sentinel Spider-Man, which is out of stock, but we're going to get more. Or maybe you want SH figure arts Goku. You know where you can go, hon. You can go to... DStarToys.com. That's right. You can go to... Bam! www.dstartoys.com. Awesome action figures. Thank you for watching. <laughs> this awful buy better toys <laughs> yeah, but just, just buy better you you guys deserve better right you deserve S better sa save your money get something money, quality get something right. that is good and right. you like <laughs> right. the argument that I guess like well what if I don't have money you know what if you saved up money and you didn't buy crap like this you can get a really good, solid quality toy. I mean, that's really the name of the game. This you don't like have the... to have a hundred toys. Just get the ones you like, good quality ones, and 
Forget the bootlegs. This is like the, do you want a marshmallow now? Yeah. Or do you want two marshmallows in a minute? Like, yeah, yeah. I, I guess that's really what it comes down like, to. This, is the, this looks like this is where he goes to the bathroom yeah, it, in it's, his it's, little onesie. It's, this is the back door situation. It's bad. It's bad. Anyway, guys, thanks I'm for sorry. watching. <laughs> do not that. forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you're always in the know when I post new videos so we can do more this is not videos because you guys seem to really really like it when i am in pain and torture looking at these weird looking figures but you know what we have more coming anyway guys thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time peace Bye. So, rate, comment, and subscribe right here, right there, right here. Yeah.